thing. And I tried to be impartial and cool about this and not get it. Man, fuck that, man. Fuck Tory Lanez, okay? And I don't care if this go viral or none of that shit. I'm from Houston, and if somebody would have done something to Megan in this city, we would have rolled. Megan in L.A. by herself. It's just her T. Ferris. She ain't got a mama no more. Her mama's gone. Her daddy is gone. Her grandmother is gone. All the people that loved her and cared about her unconditionally, that looked out for her and would have protected her, ain't there. So as an OG in Houston, I'm standing up. Tory Lane did some whole ass shit. Period. Yeah, I, I know Tory. I know his manager. I know all of them, man. Fuck all that, though. Fuck all that. If the man on drugs, get him some goddamn rehab. If the man got mental health issues, get him some therapy. But you're not just going to sit here and shoot this girl. And we not say nothing. This shit not real. This, I mean, this is not real nigga shit. It's not. Anytime a man hurts a woman, that's obsession. That ain't love. That's obsession. You know what I'm saying? And he had no reason to shoot this girl. She want to get out the car. Get out the car. You get into it with your gal. She mad. I'm a, let me out. Pull the fuck over. Because whatever you got to deal with with that, it's going to be better than if you don't do that and you try to restrain a woman and then she get physical. Because if she ready to get out the car and you don't let her get out the car, she going to get physical with you. And she got a right to. Let her out the goddamn car. No, he ain't from New York. He's from Canada. So at the very least, they're going to deport his ass. He got to go back to Canada. But when nobody's talking about it because it's a black woman. Y'all can say what y'all want. I'm just, just, that's just what it is. If Benji, the twin from Good Charlotte, had put his hands on Cameron Diaz or somebody, if some, what, you let one of these actors... Or somebody that fuck with one of these, these white women in Hollywood, put they, put your hands on Alyssa Milano and see what happens.